Oh, hi, welcome back. Where the fuck did my phone go? Oh, there it is. Huh. You never know. You never know when you're gonna need a Google shit in RPGs. It's always nice to have it right by your side. Okay, anyways, so we last left off. Uh, dog is guy, and we need him to fix bridge. I mean, I could just... Oh, or I guess not. I guess I can't jump. I could. Alright, so... Oh, do I gotta go back? Ah, oh, god. I'm expecting the minus button to be the map button for some reason. Huh. Well, I guess... Let's go that way. Alright, well, this way. Cow? Cow? <laughs> Just, ooh, let's see what kind of weather we can look forward to. Alright, weather cow. You got it. I guess if I ever see cows, I need to make sure to look for weather. Not that I know what the wet. Oh, well, what do you know? You found it. My water. <laughs> Here come my next victims. Ta -da! Introducing the one, the only Tricky Devil. Okay. Uh, hi. <laughs> hi. Hey, you're supposed to be shocked by my devilish trickiness. No, time for Plan B then. Take this. I tell you, it just sounds like Tora to me. I don't think it's necessarily the same voice. <laughs> Seriously? The only thing I'm shocked by is how lame you are. What did you just do, oh, cheeky devil? Don't you know who I am? I'll teach you for my next trick. I'm gonna beat you to a pulp! <laughs> All right. Let's do this. So, uh, so, uh, yeah. This kills him. I'm gonna really, I'm gonna laugh. Oh, nope, not dead yet. Um. Oh, group. Oh, cool. I'm gonna do flame slash. Oof, that's not good. What? Bullshit. Alright. Oh, sleeper hit. Aw, look at him sleep. It's adorable. <coughs> Alright, sleeper hit again. Oh, we didn't fall asleep this time. Uh. Well, that was easy. What? Oh. Is that, is that a boss? Nice. Was that really supposed to be a boss? Sure. Knibs. Oh, yeah, here we go. Yeah. Yeah. Cobra Strike. Stab an enemy in such a way that they're occasionally envenomated? What? I've never heard that word. I'm, I see the word venom, so I'm going to assume it's, like, poisoned. Okay. I, I forgot to look for... Oh, this can't be happening. Looks like the joke's on me this time. Eh. Oh, well, bye. <laughs> hey there, you two. Oh, look. It's our pal, the pooch. <laughs> if only this guy Not showed up in the more. fat episode. Thanks to you, I'm back to my old self. I'm Flint the Woodcutter, by the way. And I owe you more than words can possibly say. How can I ever repay you? It's funny you should ask. We were hoping that some kind soul might fix that bridge the monster smashed up. <laughs> it would be my pleasure. 
Why don't you go back to my cabin and put your feet up? I'll have it mended for you in no time flat. Well, thank you, Flint. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. Much obliged. Much obliged. <sighs> Doesn't it feel so much better without the fucking PS4? You know, you waiting, fucking blasting its air fans. Fixed. In fact, it's even sturdier than ever. Wow, how wonderful! You then we cross it and it gets broken again. Thanks, you really helped us out. Now, young fellow, about this vision of me being turned into a dog you saw when you touched that glowing plant. Yes. The more I think about it, the more certain I am. What you experienced can only have been the guidance of Yggdrasil. Yggdrasil. It's called Yggdrasil. I've been calling it Yggdrasil. It's something my dear old granddad told me about when I was a boy. Yggdrasil is the giant Yggdrasil. tree. Yggdrasil altar. World, of course. The source of all life, as some call it. If the legends are to be believed, each one of its leaves represents a life, and its power preserves the peace and harmony of our realm. I see. The tree of life. The glowing plant you found in the forest is actually a part of Yggdrasil, a piece of root poking through from beneath. Okay. It's said that the world tree can choose to communicate via her roots, but only with certain very special people. And that's what my granddad meant by the guidance of Yggdrasil. He was talking Yggdrasil. about just such visions as you saw. <laughs> it's all coming back to me now. As a boy, I'd spend hours talking to the silly old thing, but did anything ever happen? Not a bit of it. But you, young man, you're different. You're one of the special ones, chosen by the World Tree. And you've got World Tree. Too. Life just isn't fair. <laughs> got great. What? So not only are you the luminary, you're also Yggdrasil's favorite little leaf, huh? I I love this. I love the writing in this game. Well, we can't stand around talking about how great you are forever. Come on. <laughs> I love this game's writing. It's just fantastic. Just the way they describe things. Okay, cool. Remember that if you ever had a lost word again, it's a good idea to seek out one of the worlds. <sighs> Life just isn't fair. Wow. He really loves my hair. Alright, well, let's cross the bridge. Oh, well, hello, other person. Never made it over here now. Welcome. Okay. Um. Bronze Knight. It's worse. Ew. Did I heal? Okay, I'm I'm fully healed. Floating magic hats? What? Well, what are these? Sham hat witches. I I feel like I've seen this guy before. It looks familiar. It's adorable. It's like the little pigs from Wind Waker. Hey, level nine. Ooh, I learned a new spell. Evac. Sure, I got, I got some good skills, I guess. Heavy damage to all to, to heavy damage to dragons. Okay. Huh. I'll do this, I guess. You know, it's very interesting. This um this skill tree looks very similar to the one in World of Light. <laughs> in in Smash Ultimate's World of Light, it just looks very similar to it. Like 
it, it just feels way too like similar to make it to make me think it's a coincidence. Kill things in one hit now. I'm getting a, some good experience from these guys though. So. Ah. He just looks like the fucking dancing devil. Looks like you know that uncle that just wears pajama bottoms whenever you go visit him. Oh, the hardy hide. Well, all right then. No, get out of here. I don't even give that much exp. These things are so adorable. Is it the hat or the... Another one bites. Another one bites. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, um... It's all the way in this corner. What was that noise? I heard a noise. There's nothing in this corner. I forget I don't have to, um, like, actually hold up while running. It just automatically does... just automatically runs for me. Wait, how did they make the first strike? I made the first strike. That's stupid. <laughs> Bullshit. Okay. Okay, so it's 30 for... That's a really adorable hat, by the way. What? 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 What are you doing? Okay. It was like eating it. The poor, the poor pig. Alright, I'm gonna defeat this and then we're gonna head on. Don't wanna stand here forever. I did last time. I, I didn't even get to see the fiery breath. What the hell was that camera? What kind of BS was that? <laughs> what kind of BS was that with the camera? Oh, there's the cow. Alright. Alright. I'll kill that one and then the other one over there. Sham hat witches. I'm trying to think of what the... I, I see the word ham. Another one and bites the dust. It's a, it is a witch hat. So, I'm just trying to think, like, what's the, uh, like, Cruel Cumber, you know, like, I got that as a joke. I'm gonna do Sizz. That was cool. Another one bites the dust. Alright, let's go. Which way should I go? Um, well, I'll take the shorter route. I should take the longer route, but I'm gonna take the shorter route. Well, I guess I can go this way anyways. What was that? I just skipped something. What's this? A small scale. Don't know what it is. Just collect it, because you never know. Okay, now I'm feeling like there's something over here. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go over here. Whoa, what's this? Alright. Alright. Rat? <laughs> Forest rat? What's this? Single file. Okay, well, there's nothing over there. I'm gonna go back. No. Get away from me. Alright, we're gonna go. Path to Heliodor. Yes, that's right. This is where I need to go. Alright. Well, doesn't this look familiar? You really gonna attack me? Oh, they're running away. 
<laughs> yeah, that's right. Scram. Whoa, that's a lot of them. But I'll just do this. There we go. How much EXP did I get from that? Twelve. That was pretty, that was pretty shit, to be honest. Alright, let's go f see Cobblestone in Ruins. I mean, it just feels like that's what the story was leading up to. Uh, well... Oh, that's just the fire from that. Whatever happened to my horsey? It's gone. Oh. Well, there it is. Hello, horse. Goodbye, horse. Alright, well... Time... Oh, nope, everything's fine. Maybe it's not gonna be that kind of story. Alright. Pupper. Everything seems fine. What? What do you mean? I was born here. What, have people forgotten me? What is going on? What? <laughs> I hope this kid's not named Eleven and I just named myself the same thing as the kid. No, no, I don't think that's the case. I feel like we're falling into a trap, obviously. Well, it's rare to see travelers. There's always hospital. I'm sure she'll be happy to put you... Amber was our caretaker, right? I'm, I'd, I'd rather keep my clothes on, please. Okay, um... Jeez, I wish there was an indicator of where to go. For the story, at the very least. You know what I mean? Like, I, I, like... Like... The, uh, the map is great, but... Shouldn't there be, like... Markers or something to tell me where to go? Yes, it is. Is that you, dear? I'm cooking your favorite stew. It'll be ready any minute now. You'll be desperate to stuff your face as always, I'm sure. Well, set the table, and I'll just give it a last little stir. Has she forgotten me too? Whoa! Who are you? And what are you doing in my house? What nonsense are you talking? My boy is six years old. Who do you think you are, waltzing in here and claiming to be someone you're not? Whoever you are, I want you out of my house this instant. Don't make me say it twice. All right. Something's obviously wrong. <laughs> sad 11. This is his sadness face. So... Wait, what? I was wondering why the why there was a puppy here. Something is not right. What happened? It's like everything got reverted back in time. You shouldn't be saying the obvious. This is a little... 
It's Sandy! Yeah, I forgot her name. Yes. Thank you, mister. Oh, that's a little baby. I forgot her name. name's Gemma. Gemma, fuck. <laughs> Sorry, it's been a while. It's been a while. It's been like a few weeks. can't be right. Oh, wait, I get it. That's not your name. You mean you're looking for him, right? He went to look for Chalky. Come on, follow me. I feel like I'm kind of understanding the story. They're going to rewrite him to make him look like a total asshole. Like, so that the villagers hate him. Either that or the story seems to be... I don't know. This is very uh, bizarre. Like, I was expecting, like standard story about, like, you know, a wizard did it. <laughs> you know? <laughs> I mean, technically speaking, I bet you anything, it's a wizard did it. But, um, gotta admit, little baby gem is kinda cute. And then Sandy, obviously, pupper, pup, puppo Sandy. I'm following, I'm following. You're just taking for goddamn ever. Oh, hey, look, it is actually little me. Okay. I'm, I'm right behind you. Or do I have to... Okay. I'm gonna turn around, it's gonna be some dumb... Hey, oh, no. Dad, can I borrow your ladder? The wind blew Gemma's scarf off, and now it's stuck up a tree. He speaks. <laughs> well, we can't be having that now, can we? Let me go and find it for you. Mm -hmm. We don't need the ladder anymore. That nice man over there got my headscarf down for me. He said he was looking for you. Is he a friend of yours? Nope. I've never even seen him before. I think it might be me he's looking for, you know? Why don't you two run along and play and leave us grown-ups to talk? Uh-oh. All right. <laughs> Did we just somehow, like, revert back to the past or something? Oh, well, well, well. Ah, oh, shit. Sorry. It's you, isn't it? Uh, yes, it is. <laughs> I knew it. I've known you since you were a baby, after all. I knew it was you right away. But you don't look too happy, my lad. Care to tell you, old granddad, what's on your mind? What's going on? Okay. <laughs> I see. So... You're from a future where I'm no longer around. Well, well. Okay. So this guy was... You went and threw you in the dungeon. And to think I trusted that he'd do right by you. And if I'd known how things were going to turn out, I would have told you everything. Instead of hiding the truth from you for all those years. Okay. But you don't have time to be listening to an old man's regrets. Here's what we're going to do. What? I'm so... Where? You head east out of the village. You'll come to Cobblestone Falls, as you know. Go there and dig in front of the three-sided rock. Got that? Hmm? The three-sided rock at Cobblestone Falls. You'll know the one I mean. figure of a man you've become. I'm so you become Wait, okay. Happy. Don't waste your time bearing grudges. Live life with love in your heart. You always saw me, right? Bye now. What the f what? You know, where's Eric, actually? Is he... 
There's no one in the party to talk to at the moment. Okay, so this is some sort of a fever dream I'm having. Okay. Um, okay. So, now I'm expecting this place to be in ruins. In fact, I don't like the sound. It's just, the music's gotten kind of... Oh, hey, what do you know? Magical light barrier. Alright. Sorry, I just have to break these pumpkins. And barrels, and whatever. Alright, I'm done. It's my duty to do that. Okay. Now I'm kind of nervous, because now I'm expecting the whole place to be in shambles. Okay. It's empty. When am I gonna, like, wake up from it? To Little me. Come back an adorable play kid. You like. <laughs> it's very weird to hear him talk, you know, considering he's just, you know, silent protagonist. Okay. All right. Here's where we wake up and we see the tree burning, or the tree's dead, or something. Nope. Nope, oh, the tree is fine. Oh, it's one of those. Oh, okay. You okay? I lost you for a minute there. Not surprising, I guess. I guess it's one of those roots. <gasps> what do you know? <laughs> All right. I can't believe they do this. And just because you grew up here, what kind of animals are they? Jasper. I will admit they kind of played me for a bit. After you got thrown in the dungeons and torched the place. Hey, just now when you zoned out, the mark on your hand was glowing, and so was the root wrapped around that tree. Was it another one of those visions? Pro probably. I don't know. Wow. So you. You went back in time and spoke with your granddad and... and yourself? That is seriously weird. Must have been the root here. It must have the power to show you the past. Well, if what your granddad told you was right, then we need to head over to Cobblestone Falls. So now I kind of wonder what the game would be like Ridge. in 2D. I kind of want to check it out. You know what I mean? Maybe maybe one episode I'll I'll turn it over to 2D and we'll test it out, you know? Not necessarily go through the story and whatnot. Aw, sad boy 11. Listen, I know this can't be easy, but hanging around here isn't going to do anybody any good. Come on. Uh, well, at least there's somebody here. It's another fat guy. Tell rumor that this village was to be race was to be in rush from here to try to reason with the troops. And raising the accursed darkspawn. At least the troops did not destroy the church. That is something. Inside you will find a better or traveler may rest his weary bones. Okay. Okay, cool. I'm gonna make a save. I'm going to use the unused saved. Also, it looks like I have nine nine spaces for saving. That's pretty that's pretty cool. I mean it's still kinda a little dirty. Hey chest. Oh look, it's a taco. I'm just gonna call him taco from now on. Because I find it funny now. Templar's uniform. I guess tacos kind of give you secrets? I don't know. Ok. 
Come on, come on. There you go. So... Gemma and Sandy and Amber. So we got to I guess we got to find that rock. A piece of pink pine. Well, I hope I didn't leave anything behind here. I'm pretty sure I did whatever small quests there I don't even remember there being any quests here. Oh no, there was one. There was one involving me grabbing something on a Yeah, I remember I did that. So, yeah, I did that. So, oh, uh, hello, nighttime. It's like the second time that's happened. Okay. Okay, um. Hey. Head to the Emerald Coast. Okay. Um. Oh, I gotta check my home. I think I was just up here. Here's where my house was. I can actually sleep. Oh, that still looks comfortable enough. Sure. We'll sleep on my bed for one more time. But why? So, are they just gone? Alright. Well, maybe they'll show up later. I don't know. Maybe they're like refugees at the castle or something. Want to know how many items we have? Oh! Alright, Emerald Coast. Alright, horse. Let's go. So they said east. East is right here, and this leads to the Emerald Coast. The road to the Emerald Coast. Photo mode. Oh, that's right. I was messing around with that before. Mount. Boom! Jug of fresh water. Somebody just left a jug and I just filled it up. I feel like I was gonna say something, but I completely forgot. <sighs> Why is there no swimming? I mean, come on, man. It's like, it's 2019, you know? Even even if it's not an action RPG, it's not like it needs that, you know. Just fucking just have it be a thing. Excuse me, what are these? What? What is that? Let's do this. All right, a gloomy grublin. They don't look so gloomy to me. There you go. What? How did you not die? Fine, sis. Alright. Boom. Alright. Alright, not dead. Should be dead by this. Yeah, there we go. Boom. Yeah. Laughs flippantly. So much for be- Are you fucking- Get out of here. Garbage. Garbage. Get out of here. <laughs> Look how far they send them flying. Alright, here's an item. 
Oh, can I just pick it up from there? Oh, jeez. I'm thinking this is like Zelda. You know? Can you imagine if you gained experience from that? How broken of a game would this be? What? <laughs> okay. I was like, why did you stop me? Whoa, what is that? Are these giant eggs? They're like giant robot eggs. Okay. Robots? Egg... Egg... Sos? Egg... Egg... So... Skeleton... Oh my fucking god. It took me a while to figure it out. It's like, excuse me. Exoskeleton. Get out of here. Still trying to figure out the uh, pun for this. Sham Hat Witch. Easy. Wait. Wait. Is this supposed to be like Ham Sandwich? Is that supposed to be it? Is that the joke? <laughs> Just boom. Boom. Okay. Okay, um... It said east. Oh, well, there's a giant sea house. Huh. Oh, cool. So I don't have to get off. Excuse me, what is this? What are these? Alright, we've got a crabbed calamari kid. Alright. Alright, I'm gonna put this thing to sleep, hopefully. Oh, it worked. Alright, and then I'm going to... Let's... Yeah, let, let's attack that. Jeez. Holy crap. Okay, um... What? Uh, equipment. Um, no, what? Where is the freaking... How come I can't... Ugh. Equipment... How do I get to... How do I get to, like, the medicinal herbs and stuff? I, was, I couldn't do this before for some reason. Alright, whatever. I'll just use heal, I guess. Alright. Okay. Yeah, stay asleep, buddy. Don't let its size fool you. What size? What, the crabbed? Get out of here. <laughs> crabbed? A rabid crab? Excuse me. Excuse me? What was, what was that? You can't continue this way while mounted. I mean... You could have just had an invisible wall. It's alright. Fishing. It'll get to my head. No point dragging your hide all the way out here otherwise. Thank you. Buff buff fisherman. Probably has a daily dose of protein. Sorry man, I'm just gonna just thank you. I just need to do that. <clears throat> Okay. Okay, I'm actually going to assume that there's going to be like some sort of a sea travel like uh mount of some kind. These guys do give some good experience. It would be pretty good, but nah. I'm going to go back on my horse. Okay, I guess I'm fighting this thing. Alright, um... This is bad, really? What? <laughs> They're adorable! Why Why do they do this? Why are they, why are they doing this? You know, that was an easy fight. 
Calamari Kid. I kind of like that name. All right. All right. Um, where's the three rocks again? Well, oh no, that's that. Okay. Oh, wait, no. <sighs> yes. Well, whatever. Every time I save, I want to make sure... <sighs> God. Okay. Get out of here. Get out of here. What's in this tree? I will take the buzzberries. Uh, somehow a file is in the tree as well. Um... Okay. Is it all the way over there? Okay, that's where the Kingsboro is. Oh, it's near Cobblestone Falls. Okay, I'm an I'm stupid. I've gotta gotta pay attention. So that's that's the big issue. I don't think if I pay attention, I think I'm gonna have a lot of issues getting lost. Though part of me is just kind of like thinking like, why did they just have a? Why don't they just have a uh, thing to tell you? Wait, this was just where I was at. Ugh. The three-sided rock? Oh. Alright, this is the three-sided rock. Ugh. I passed it this whole time. Huh? The top one there has seen better days, that's for sure. My dearest, darling baby boy, when finally you come to read this, I will almost certainly be long dead. You see, not long after you were born, our beloved kingdom of Dundrazil was attacked by an army of monsters. I was forced to flee with you in my arms, and expended the last of my strength in ensuring that you escaped to safety. If you are fortunate oh, enough shit. to have been found by some kindly soul, you must seek out the King of Heliodor when you come of age. Our kingdom and his have long enjoyed close relations, and your father and I would trust him with our lives. Never forget, my son. You are a prince of the kingdom of Dundrazil. But more than that, you are the luminary. Yours is a weighty burden indeed. It is you who must stand against the darkness and banish it from our world. In time, you will come to understand. It breaks my heart to leave you, my darling. But it is the only way. I only hope that one day you will learn to forgive me. It's from someone important to you, right? Your mother or something? Don't worry, you can tell me about it later. What about the other one? That's a very old letter. Oh, look, a gem. To my dearest grandson. I haven't the foggiest how you managed it, but I met your future self today. As promised, what, really? I buried some things here that will help you on your way. I what? read your mother's letter yet. It was in your basket with you when I first found you. It was because of that letter that I asked my Amber to send you to see the king when the time came. I only wish I'd known how things would turn out. I don't know why Dundrasil was attacked, or why King Carnelian thinks so badly of you. I'm just an ignorant old man from a little village in the country. But I do know that the answers are out there somewhere. 
The keystone in this box will open the door Wait. of departure. Wait, the he east. he sent Amber to you tell the king? The world and seek the truth. Wait, what? Remember now. Don't waste your time bearing grudges and live life with love in your heart. All the best. Now and forever. Grandad. Okay, so I have the ability to rewrite time, I guess. So we use the keystone to open the door of departure and head out into the world, huh? Well, sounds easy enough. You better believe I'm coming with you. You said it was just east of here, right? Well, what are we waiting for? Oh, I know what we're waiting for. I've got some unfinished business to attend to. The orb. Yeah, pretty much. The King's Barrow is not too far from here. And just down the way, in fact. Yeah, I know. We but passed it multiple times. <laughs> okay. All right. So... So he sent Amber to go talk to the king? So in that turn, let... But I'm... I'm so confused. I'm genuinely confused about this now. Well, um, just gonna let the story write itself, uh, or let the story go on. Um, I'm so confused by that whole letter. I'm gonna have to see. I'm gonna have to see if I can read that again. To make sure I understand it correctly. Also, it just auto got me off the horse. That sucks. All right, so this is the next dungeon. <sighs> okay. What's in here? I'm gonna break these pots. Fuck you. Fuck you. What's this? I saw I thought I saw something over here. Nope. <sighs> King's Barrow Entranceway. <gasps> oh. The guards are dead. What the heck happened here? Or sleeping. Are they dead? Are they dead or unconscious? Oh, they're d oh oh. I thought I thought that sword was stuck through them. <laughs> it's just a corpse. So they're dead. Okay. Um. Okay, this game is rated T. Okay. There hasn't there hasn't really they haven't shown blood. Okay, they haven't shown blood yet. Wait, wait. What what's the thing for T rating? Mild blood, crude humor, fantasy violence, simulated gambling. Simulated gambling? That that bumps it to T. I think that's true. Wait, the original Pokemon games got bumped to T rating when they were released on the 3DS, right? I think that makes sense. Simulated gambling, though, suggests the theme's use of alcohol. Use of alcohol. I haven't seen any alcohol in this. Alright, another corpse. Well, this is... this is interesting. What time... oh shit, we're 50 minutes in this? Wait, there's a... but something's been hurriedly scrawled on the dust next to it. To the altar, hurry, the orb, the writing trails off after them. The poor soldier must have run out of strength. All right. Well. Eric. Eric. Eric, please. Please. Eric. Eric, please. Please. Stop it. Oh, my God. 
How's it going? Now, if there's anything I've learned from my years of, re of relieving people of their possessions, is that you always find treasure in the last place you look. <sighs> That's the last place you look? I don't get it. Wouldn't the f wouldn't the last place you look be the be the most obvious place? That this leads back out. Um, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to pause the game. We're gonna end the episode here. I'm gonna record one more episode, hopefully after this, and uh, we'll continue on. Um, I know it's another another ten minute ten minute early episode, but um, I feel like that would be the best case scenario right now. I don't want to continue, and then all of a sudden, I got this like huge boss fight that I gotta beat, and then it's gonna be like super long cutscenes and whatnot, you know. So definitely make made some good story progress, though. Um, I'll see you guys in the next episode.